You ever wonder what kind of home being a wildly successful internet star and a model can buy you? Well today guys I'm going to show you inside of Hannah Stocking's new 2.4 million dollar home. Before we dive into today's video it has come to our attention that 96% of you guys who watch our videos are not subscribed. So if everyone watching this video could hit that subscribe button help us get to our goal of 100,000 subscribers that would be much appreciated. Hannah Stocking's new 2.4 million dollar home is located in Los Angeles County, California. For the safety and privacy of Hannah as well as the rest of her friends and family, we will not be releasing the address or town it's located in. We also encourage you to respect her privacy by not sharing the address or visiting the home at any time. The $2.4 million home is set on roughly half of an acre of land with a cute backyard space. The home was built in 1979 and has seen renovations over the years, bringing it to the home you see today. Hannah purchased the home in June of 2020 for $2,325,000. What I already like about this home is it's not like other social media stars' homes that are modern compounds. This house actually feels a little bit more like a home. Outside of the hefty purchase price, Hannah will be looking at roughly $18,000 per year in property taxes and an additional $10,000 per year in homeowner's insurance. What's nice about the new property is she'll be well within driving distance to many other famous internet stars such as Logan Paul. The home is a six bedroom and seven bathroom with 5,827 square feet of living space breaking down to about $399 per square foot. Entering into the home, you're greeted by vaulted ceilings with a light fixture hanging from above, which opens up into the main living area. Straight into the living room, you have an open floor plan which features a gas fireplace. Attached is the kitchen which comes with painted white cabinets with marble countertops and top of the line appliances. The chef style stove is outlined with a stone arch which acts as a focal point for the space, which I absolutely love. Just off the kitchen is a small wine cellar which could hold just under 50 different bottles. Across the hall is where you'll find the dining room which features vaulted ceilings with a cool chandelier hanging from above. Down the hall is a small den which has another gas fireplace and doors to the backyard. Outside there is a barbecue area located off to the side and right next door is a built-in gas fire pit perfect for summer nights. There is a large in-ground pool with an attached hot tub smack in the center of the backyard space. There is plenty of patio space and a pergola to relax under and soak up some California sun. Attached to the backyard is a dirt patch that could eventually be a place for a jungle gym if Hannah plans on having kids anytime soon. But it's also a great place if she ever wants to build the detached guest house. Speaking of guest houses, there is a one bedroom guest house over the garage which features a kitchenette and its own private bathroom. I wouldn't really consider it a guest house since it's just a one room space attached to the main house but it's definitely a place to separate yourself from the rest of the home. Stepping back inside and up the stairs to the second floor is where you'll find the remaining bedrooms including the master. In the master you have a large stone fireplace with doors that open up to your own private balcony. I love the vaulted ceilings in this room and it's something I strive to have in my own home one day. Stepping into the master bathroom, you have his and hers vanities on separate walls of the room with a freestanding soaking tub off to the side. Around the corner is a large walk-in closet with room for all of Hannah's clothes, and I'm sure she will fill it up. The remaining bedrooms on the second floor surprisingly don't come with their own ensuite bathrooms, but there's a shared bathroom with dual vanities for the guests to share. But that pretty much wraps up our tour of Hannah Stocking's new $2.4 million home. I would love to hear what your favorite part is about the $2.4 million house by leaving it down in the comments section down below. As well, if you had $2.4 4 million dollars laying around is this a home you'd purchase that wraps up today's video if you guys enjoyed make sure to hit that subscribe button and follow us on all of our social media accounts located in the description thanks for watching and we'll see you next time